The following audio may contain the personal testimonials of some independent Optavia coaches or clients of Optavia. The results relayed in these messages are based on the unique experiences of the participants and we cannot guarantee you like or similar outcomes. While you may be inspired by these accounts, please note that any stories of success have not been verified and your individual path to healthy living and weight loss will vary. As always, it is our recommendation that you consult with a healthcare provider before starting a weight loss program. In addition, this audio may contain income or earnings representations of some independent Optavia coaches. Optavia makes no guarantee of financial success. Success with Optavia results from successful sales efforts, which requires hard work, diligence, skill, persistence, competence, and leadership. Please see the Optavia income disclosure statement for statistics on actual earnings of coaches under the U.S. Compensation Plan, which differs from the International Compensation Plan. Yours in health, the Optavia team. Man, I am so excited to be able to spend some time with you all tonight with Kat, my beautiful wife. And I'm not going to say it's her fault that we're here because it's not. I'm grateful every day that we're here because of her making the choice to get healthy and choose to look at things from a different perspective. And what a blessing it's been for me personally, for her, for our family. We are just so grateful for this opportunity to, to have Optivia in our lives and the difference that it's made. We had our youngest son there that's in the middle of the picture. So she said, my friend's a coach and I'm doing her program. And uh, she said, give me the credit card. And I said, here's the credit card. And while we're at it, why don't you go ahead and uh, sign me up too. And we got started as clients and uh, Kat decided to pay it forward and help other people because of the difference that that had made in our lives. And that really opened the door for us to what's possible. We started looking at life from a different lens. We started dreaming in a different way than we ever had before. And so tonight you're gonna to get to hear some amazing stories and, and a little bit, um, you know, I'll probably add a couple of things in there that hopefully have some value as well. Um, I just wanna talk a little bit about our company, just our credibility, just so that you know. That amazing man on there is Dr. Anderson and he is not just a mentor, he is a friend and we, we love him dearly. And man, I get emotional, holy crap. Um, almost 20 years ago, he packed up his little family and he left critical care. He's the 10th board certified critical care physician in the country. He packed his family, moved from Ohio to Oregon, to Oregon. And he decided at that time, instead of reacting to disease, he was going to create, create health in people's lives. He wanted to help create health in, health in people's lives. And now we're at a point where our company is one of America's most trusted companies year in and year out. We've, we've built the credibility. We've built the framework that we can be trusted. Our parent company is amazing. We're just so blessed to just have this amazing backbone, if you will, to everything that we do. And I love that our currently in the situation we're in, we have an essential business where we have medical grade facilities. We're a New York stock exchange company that's, that's, strategically placed in a good place for uh, where we are and moving forward. Oh man. So what is Optavia? We are lifelong transformations, one healthy habit at a time. And that's what we want to create and help everyone create in their own lives is healthy habits, just one healthy habit at a time, healthy lives. So some of the statistics we want to just share with you tonight are a little, it's just, always so interesting to me to read these and I think about the first one that you see on your screen worldwide obesity has nearly tripled since 1975 that was the year I was born and worldwide obesity has almost tripled in the time in my lifetime and I that, you were only 25 oh yeah how did that happen? I don't know <laughs> um sorry to most <laughs> of the world's population lives in countries where overweight and obesity kills more people than underweight and in America, we see almost a third of our adults with partners, 31% report that money is a major source of conflict in their relationship. 69% of workers were stressed over their finances with 72% admitting to worrying about their personal finances at work. Those are some eye-opening statistics. I think that's the best way to put it. Lucky for us within our community, we have four components that really help people create health in their lives. We, everybody gets a coach. We have an amazing community to help people through this process. 
we have our Habits of Health transformational system that really helps us rewire the space between the ears, right? We get to rewire that space between our ears. We get to look at things differently. We get to look at stress and everything differently. As you say that, I think about the last statistics we just saw, and Dr. A always talks about the, the biggest risk outside it for, for people in their lives is emotional mismanagement because we don't know how to handle our emotions and we buffer them with food or stress or things that we shouldn't. And anyway, that just hit me while you were talking about that. And this Habits of Health transformational system is so powerful in combating that. Yeah. We have our Optum Fuelings, which are so amazing. Our Optavia Fuelings just literally add peace in our home because I most of the time don't have to worry about you know, what do we have that's healthy to eat? And that just really takes the pressure off. And I know it does for most people. We are super excited to have a dear friend share, but I want Kat to introduce her because they've gone, they go way back. We go way back to 25 years plus, probably. So this is my friend, Jen. We, we met on the softball field at um, Brigham Young University in Provo, Utah, and have became fast friends. She was my, she was my athletic trainer and she, I'm the one that gets hurt and puts myself in danger a lot. So, so Jen was able to help me out. And, um, when I found Octavia, I was lucky enough to get to offer it to her and, and maybe, maybe pay back the favor on how much she helped me. So, um, I'll let her share her story. Jen, come on. Hey guys, thanks so much for having me on. What a great introduction and it's fun to look at those pictures there. Um, you know, my story, I hope that sharing my story today will uh, just give someone on here a little bit of hope and sharing my husband's story too. So my story has several different avenues and um, so I hope I can bring them all together the right way. But really my journey started about three years ago when I was just looking for something that would help me. And so I reached out to Kat and John, who I knew um, were coaching and asked them, you know, if they thought their program would be something that was good for me. So of course they said yes. And I got on program and um, to my dismay and kind of my embarrassment, I lasted for four whole days, four, four days, you guys, I lasted four days and I called them up and said, I just can't do it. And they were very, very encouraging and tried to encourage me to continue, but ultimately said, Hey, you know, maybe it's just not the right time for you, but just know that we're here for you when it is the right time. So I appreciated that. And I went about my way and just trying to do my own thing, trying to get healthy. And so this fast forward about a year and a half and my husband, Mark was, or, or he is, um, he has type one diabetes and he was struggling with his health and, um, just looking for different ways, trying different things on his own to get healthy. And I was trying to help him the best that I could. And, uh, finally I said, Hey, let's re reach out to Kat and John and just see if the program will work for you. And uh, so we did, and he got on program, and um, we started to see, he started to feel better, and things were just looking so good. And so within five or six months, he was able to reach a healthy weight and just feeling fantastic. So I told Kat and John, if this program worked for them, uh, or for him, that I would uh, become a coach. And so about halfway through his journey, I said, okay, I'm... I'm ready to become a coach. What do I need to do? So of course, first I need to tell them. Uh oh. You're good, keep going. Okay, I don't know where my screen went. Um, first I needed to try the program. And uh, so I thought, well, you know, I've always been pretty physically fit and I've eaten healthy-ish, but that um, healthy-ish began to catch up with me. I always was able to outrun my fork, if you will. And so I decided um, to do the program. And this time I was successful in doing it and was able to reach a healthy weight. I actually didn't realize um, how much I needed to improve my health. And, you know, I really didn't know how unhealthy I felt until um, I felt healthy again. 
and it was such a fantastic feeling and continues to be. He um, continues to maintain his weight and health and, and feels great, and I've been able to maintain mine as well. So as I began to um, coach, I just started out coaching, just wanting to help a couple people, you know, maybe somebody that reached out to me. And um, as I got coaching, it was so fun and so fulfilling to be able to be a part of people's healthy journey that I, I got more and more involved. And I'm just so grateful that I did because not only am I able to do something fun and fulfilling, I'm able to watch people's lives change as they adopt um, and adapt to these healthy habits. And I'm just so grateful for that. And on top of that, I'm able to help myself and my family maintain good health also. And I'm, I'm grateful to Kat and John for that. And I'm grateful for the chance to share with you guys because this program has done so much for our family. Um, grateful to know about it and to be able to share it. And um, again, if you're somebody that maybe has tried and failed before, don't give up. It, it's going to be your right time, if not now, sometime. It will be the right time for you and you'll be able to, to hang in there and do this program and, and feel all of the blessings that come from it. Not only the physical blessings, but the personal development that has happened through this program has been as equally, if not greater, um, for me than, than the physical transformation. That mental and emotional transformation that I've been able to enjoy has been fantastic. And so I encourage you to just hang in there and keep going. And um, I hope that this will help someone uh, that's looking at this program. Thanks so much, Kat. And yeah, thank you. And I, I hope that all those hours of stretching my hamstring back 25 years <laughs> ago that I pulled, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I hope that, that somehow we've helped you as much as you helped me back in the day. And, and I'm so grateful to get to work with you. It's been such a blast. And, and I love that the, the future, just anything is possible now. Absolutely. Thank you so much. And hey, you guys, I, I can't see anything or have any mute or anything. So if you know how to turn me off of there, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I, love it. I love it. Okay. Okay. So I love Optavia in our community because we really have this trilogy of health, healthy body, healthy mind, healthy finances. And that is really what we consider as the way to lead us towards optimal health. And so, um, hang on. There are a lot of benefits of becoming a coach and we just wanna share these with you because I can tell you from firsthand experience, um, these have been things that have made a huge difference in our life. I mean, Kat kind of in the beginning was like, definitely I wanna, I wanna be able to reinforce my decision to be healthy. I wanna stay healthy, but I wanna help people too. So it's really cool because you get to do both. Not only does it encourage you to stay healthy, but it encourages you to help other people in that process too. We have a lot of fun. Our community is amazing. Um, we get paid to help other people. And that is such a blessing because think about it. There are so many professions out there where people get paid to help other people. We are one of those professions. And I love that. And I, I, I saw it in the chat a few times that, you know, finances is a stress for a lot of people. And we have the opportunity through Optavia to be able to add another stream of income for people to help them help other people and really create a legacy that they can leave for their families. It's so true. I wanna introduce our next guest. And this girl, as you can see by the picture, she's going to share a, a very heartfelt story. Um, she Grab has, your tissues, I have yeah, mine, I know. no lie. You, there, there are people that come in your life and you just know that they're special. And that's what I thought of Kaylee the first time I met her. So I'm just gonna let her jump off mute and share her story. Thanks so much, you guys. You're gonna like start me out emotional and I was gonna do so good <laughs> through all of this. <clears throat> all right, so let's see how far I can go before I cry. Um, so my name's Kaylee Gubler. As they introduced me, I have been an independent Optavia coach for three and a half years now. Um, Optavia has been one of the biggest blessings of my life, physically, mentally, financially. Um, I'm somewhat of an atypical coach, just meaning that I came into this business already at my healthy weight. Um, however, I did yo-yo I did the same 25 to 30 pounds. Um, it, it came on when I was in sixth grade and I lost it and I gained it and I lost and I gained it all the way up until after my 
my second baby, my little Zoe there. Um, and so um, for me, um, that the last time I lost it several years ago, um, it took me two and a half years to lose that 25 pounds on my own, which is like a pound a month, pretty much, right? Like that's pretty excruciatingly slow. Um, but I was a stress eater. I'm a recovering sugar addict. Um, I know I would have gained my weight back um, if I had not found this program, if I hadn't started coaching for this program. Um, I used to be so such a slave to food. Um, I actually had what I called our junk box. Like that's literally, it, it was a cardboard box and it said junk box on it. And I would pull it down every single night. Um, I put my girls to bed and I was stressed and I was tired and I didn't know how to cope with those um, unpleasant feelings. And so I would just eat until I was sick. I would eat cookies and um, Oreos and chocolate until I just like was just sick. And I did it every single night. Um, and so becoming a coach has been the best health insurance for me because what you teach is what you become. And I'm certainly not perfect in my healthy habits, but I have been able to maintain my healthy weight because I finally feel like I have the tools I need to be able to overcome these emotional eating habits that I've had my whole life. Um, it keeps me accountable to my own health. And so now if you're wondering who this adorable little girl is on this slide here, I'm gonna tell you about her. So my daughter, Zoe, um, she was diagnosed she was diagnosed with T-cell lymphoma um, 14 months ago. Oh, my goodness. Um, she was a happy, healthy, thriving three-year-old. Um, you know, just um, everything was good and healthy. And just one day we got her out of the tub and she had this lump on her neck. And we're like, what is this? And anyways, I'll spare you the details. But five days later, um, a chest x-ray confirmed that she had a giant fast growing tumor in her chest. Um, it was the size of three of her hearts. Um, it was actually compressing her airways and her, and her heart and she was struggling um, to live. And it just happened so fast, like out of nowhere. Um, so it hit us like a, like a whirlwind. Um, and so if you don't know much about blood cancer, like I didn't know, anything about it. Um, they treat it for a very long time. So it's not something that they cut open and remove and it's gone. Um, there's trillions of blood cells and so they treat them for a long time um, to make sure that they get every little spare floating cell in there that eventually they kill it and the body replenishes it hopefully this time um, cancer free. So uh, we were told that if everything went well, best case scenario two and a half years um, is what she'd be looking at for chemotherapy treatments. Um, the most intense being the first eight months. And so now we are halfway through treatment and happy news is that she's doing great. Um, so Kaylee, I think you froze. Oh, we uh -oh. lost her. We lost Kaylee. <laughs> oh no. Oh my gosh, you guys. All right. Are you there? Do we have her back? We have her back. Yeah, sorry, I don't know where I went. That was weird. <laughs> that is okay, keep sharing, because I'm like, seriously, have the tissue, so keep going. <laughs> awesome, so sorry about that. Um, I don't know where it cut me off, but basically, I was saying we're halfway through treatment, so that's good news. Um, but I wanna kind of take you back a little bit into my life. Um, the first month of Zoe's diagnosis, we literally had to live in the hospital. Um, I have other two other young children as well. If you can see in my family picture, I have a seven-year-old and a one-year-old little boy. Um, and so at the time of diagnosis, um, my little baby was five months old and he had to sleep in her tiny shower in her hospital room. And I had to stay there with my kindergartner and we were just all stuck in this tiny room all day long. Um, and so this job allowed me to be able to take a couple steps back from my business. Um, I still did what I could. I supported the clients and the coaches that I had. I remember making calls in between nurses coming in and out and in between chemo doses and baby naps. Um, but it was such an incredible blessing for me to be able to watch not only my business maintain, but to grow during this time. Um, as it was incredibly stressful. Um, I was able to focus on my daughter and her fight to stay alive. Um, 
while being able to work less hours and provide extra income for our family. Um, and medical bills are not cheap. <laughs> so it's been such a blessing. Um, I'm so grateful for a job that has allowed me to be so flexible that I could just fill it in the cracks where I could fit it in as life as we knew it was literally crumbling down around us. Um, coaching actually came to me at a time when we were hurting financially. Um, I had worked as a waitress and I had had our two daughters all through my husband's grad school. And as he worked hard to get his doctorate degree um, and he was picking up random jobs and we, he worked in between classes and homework. Um, we were actually living off of food stamps and <laughs> we looked forward to the day when he'd graduate and have a real job. Um, it turns out though that even with the real job, um, he didn't even end up making enough to be able to pay off the massive student loan debt that it took to get the massive degree, right? Um, and I just remember telling my mentor coach that if I could just make a few hundred dollars a month, that would just be life changing. Um, to tell you the truth, I didn't believe that it would happen for me. I was nothing special. I just knew, I just knew, like I didn't have what it took to be successful. Um, but desperation over our financial situation and my passion for health had led to me giving it a try. Um, and I was amazed and excited to set a new goal when I was finally able to, or as I was quickly able to surpass that financial goal. Um, and that's what this program has helped me to do. It's helped me to dream and it's helped me to dream big. Um, it's been so fun to create a vision board and not limit myself based on how little I think I can achieve. Um, there are things on there like traveling, paying for a stranger's groceries at the store, paying off debt, building our dream, dream home, donating money to good causes and our church. Um, it has been so fun to start crossing things off of that list. Um, and so these are all things that have inspired me to work hard and stay consistent in this business. Um, so crazy enough, I was actually able to make more than my husband these last couple of months, <laughs> who went to seven years of intense schooling to, to become a doctor of physical therapy. So I never would have believed that that was a possibility for little old me. So um, I guess that's kind of my end note is you don't have to be anything special or amazing or magical to be an incredible coach. Um, you really just have to have a heart and to you know, a big heart and just be willing to learn. If you can be willing to learn and be coached, like you can do anything with this job. All the skills are learnable. So that's well, it. Thanks for that. Thank you so much for oh sharing. Me. We, you are the picture of a growth mindset through all of this and going through, I, I know everyone in the chat is crying. So um, thank you so much for sharing. You know, I just really, the hard part for me is that I have to follow up these two wonderful stories and just share a few things with you because honestly, for me, I'm like, mic drop, just be done. I'm just going to say this. If you're, you're still with us and you're watching this and you heard Jen's story and you heard Kaylee's story and your heart is not bursting out of your chest to help other people. Oh my gosh, like I'm dying right now. But what I love is that this is a model that we can use. You don't have to be somebody who knows everything. That's what I love. You don't have to be at your goal. That's what I love. You can literally be one bar ahead of the person you're helping, link arms, and together you can make this thing happen. And that's what I love about this. You, you get to be your own, it's your own business. You're an independent contractor with Optimia. If you wanna work full-time or part-time or whatever, you get to choose. And if you have life experiences happen, we work together as a team to help each other through these things. And so, you know, some, sometimes things happen. Um, what I love too is that you don't have to have an inventory. It's not like I've got a garage full of stuff. I love that, by the way. Super flexible when you want to work. You and, just and do from work. where? From yeah. the hospital in between chemo drips. <laughs> yeah. Or you know, we like to go to where it's sunny sometimes, and so we just take our business with us. And when the kids aren't in school, and we just go places, and we love that. And there's tons of training and support that we provide. That's just part of the thing. You know, we we have that. And so as coaches, we have our Optavia Learning Center. You come in and you just come with a clean slate, come with an open mind, and you get to earn money as you learn the process. We work with a mentorship style, an apprenticeship style, if you will, right? So you have a business coach that's going to work with you. You have a mentorship team that's got your back. You get to learn. You get to go at your pace. We have tons of events. We just had an amazing event this last weekend. And it was a virtual event. It was supposed to be in Miami. And we were all looking forward to some sunshine. And because of the current 
because of some things that have happened, I'll just say that, we decided to take that to a virtual level. And it was amazing to be able to take that virtual experience and plug in some people that couldn't go to that live event. So it was amazing. What I love too is we take people through this process of you start out being a coach and then you move to a spot where you become a business coach and you get to help other coaches. And then you get to be, become a business leader where you get to, to help multiple people grow through this process. And you know, we meet you where you are. So if you have that, even a small inkling inside of you that's like, I wonder what this might look like for me. Follow that, go with that and see where it's going to lead you. Because I can tell you right now, 10 years ago, if you would have asked me what I would be doing, fast forward to today, I, I didn't even know that Opti, Optivia existed. So I couldn't have said I was going to be opti, doing Optivia. But now I look back and I go, this is such a blessing. I can't even imagine my life without Optivia. Me too. And I'm so grateful that I came in um, having done something completely different professionally in my past that I came in and I had a coach and a business coach and a business leader that has helped me progress and that I never felt alone. You guys, we all do this together. So if you're interested in learning more and talk to the person who invited you to this and, and join our mission because it really is about lifelong transformation. And as you heard tonight, it's not just about physical transformation. We see, we heard stories of, of mental and spiritual and um, emotional and all financial. Kind of financial, all these different things that we can help people live a better life, one healthy habit at a time. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. Have an amazing week. Look forward to seeing you back next week. This audio may have contained the personal testimonials of some independent Optavia coaches or clients of Optavia. The results relayed in these messages are based on the unique experiences of the participants and we cannot guarantee like or similar outcomes. While you may be inspired by these accounts, please note that any stories of success have not been verified and your individual path to optimal health will vary. As always, it is our recommendation that you consult with a healthcare provider before starting a weight loss program. In addition, this audio may have contained income or earnings representations of some independent Optavia coaches. Optavia makes no guarantee of financial success. Success with Optavia results from successful sales efforts, which requires hard work, diligence, skill, persistence, competence, and leadership. Please see the Optavia Income Disclosure Statement for statistics on actual earnings of coaches under the U.S. Compensation Plan, which differs from the International Compensation Plan. Yours in health, the Optavia team.